Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to recreate this look that I have going on. So as you guys know, I'm using the Kylie Cosmetics Valentine's Day um, palette. But to start off, I'm taking this Carly Bible and I'm taking the lightest shade and applying it all over my lid because I want this to be my vase. Right after this, I'm taking the lavender shade from this palette and I'm going to apply it right on top of my crease because I want this to be the base for my peach color from the Kylie Cosmetics palette. So now I'm taking this color as you guys already know, it's the peach color and as you guys can see it's really pigmented so I'll just suggest you guys take a little bit because a little goes a long way and you don't want to ruin this. Oh, and I almost forgot the brush that I'm using is from Morphe. This is the E27 brush. And I'm pretty sure you guys seen it before on my videos because I really like it. It really helps you blend a lot. Now moving on, I'm taking this flat brush and I'm just using my regular concealer to clean my inner portion of the eyes. And I'm going to tap on it with a beauty blender because I don't want it to be too creamy. Because this is where I'm going to be applying my glitter. Now just because I want this color to be closer to my inner corners, I'm just taking this pencil brush and I'm going all over it. Now going back to my palette, I'm taking this shimmery shade right here and I'm applying it on top of the concealer that I had applied because I want this to be the background for my glitter. So this is the glitter and the glue that I'm going to be using. It is from NYX Cosmetics. And I'm just going to apply the glue on my inner portion of the eyes. And then I'm going to move over to the glitter and just take a flat brush and apply it all over it. And after this, I'm just going to be doing the same thing on the other eye. So this is how it looks. Now I'm going back to my palette and taking the darkest shade. And I'm going to take the E27 brush again and I am blending this on my outer V. So the reason why I went and took this shade is because I just feel like the glitter looks even better with a darker shade at the end. Now moving over to concealer, I'm using the Laura Galore concealer in the shade medium and I'm applying it all over my under eye area with this flat brush. So as you guys can see, I'm also using this concealer as my highlighter. So I'm applying it on my forehead, on my chin, on my lips. Not on my lips, but on top of my lips. On my nose and under my contour zone. To blend this, I'm using my Diamond Shade Beauty Blender. And then I'm going back with my regular little beauty blender. Because I want to make sure that I get into the spots that my other beauty blender couldn't get. Because it is huge. Now just because I messed this up with my concealer, I'm going back with my brush and a little bit of eyeshadow and I'm blending this on my outer V because I want this to look a little messy. So to bronze up my face, I'm using this BH Cosmetics um, Contour Kit and I'm just going to take this brush from e.l.f. and I'm going all over my face with it. After this, to set my face, I'm using the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder and I'm taking my Beauty Blender and I am applying it all over my under eyes area. I am also applying it under my contour areas because I want this line to be sharp and then I'm taking just a little bit on my forehead.
After I'm done baking, to remove this, I'm using this powder brush from e.l.f. Cosmetics. So now for my lower lash line, I'm taking this flat brush, then I'm going to change to another blending brush, of course. However, I'm using the pinkish shade that I used at first from the Kylie Cosmetics, which is a little peach. And then I'm going back in with the darkest shade. So now going into my Naked 3 palette, I'm using the darkest shade from this palette and I am applying it on my outer V. And I'm going to blend this with my E27 brush. And this is how it looks. Now I'm going back to my Kylie Cosmetics palette and I'm taking the pink shade and I am applying it on top of that one that I had just used. Just because even though I like how dark it was, I want it to be a little more pink. For blush, I'm taking this one from Kylie Cosmetics and moving on to highlight. I'm using the Anastasia and Nicole. And I'm using this shade and then I'm going in with the pink one, which is I think is Kitty Cat. And taking this pencil brush, I'm also applying a little bit of highlight on my inner corners. Now for lashes, I'm taking these from Ardell. These are the fake mink lashes. And I am applying this with the dual glue. This is the one that dries in black. And of course, I haven't forget about mascara. Like, who does? I'm taking my Better Than Sex mascara. And I am going to forward this because you guys did it so many times for me. So for lipstick, I'm starting with this lip liner from NYX. And then I'm going to be using the Kylie Cosmetics Lip Kits. This is the Posey K. And I literally forgot the other name. Um, I'll find it and I'll list it down below because I literally forgot. <laughs> Actually, I think I do know the name. This is Posey K and Coco K. I think Posey is the darker one and Coco is the lighter one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it should be like that. Going back to my highlighter, I'm just going all over the areas. Yeah, I've already applied it and on top of my nose as well. So this is it guys, thanks for watching, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe and comment down below if you guys want to tell me something specific. Bye!